good morning and welcome back to the grammar period today we are going to learn a new lesson but before that who will tell me what we have studied in the last period yes sentences i hope you all have understood sentences and its two parts subject and predicate so our today's topic is prepositions what is a preposition a preposition is a word that tells us where a person an animal a place or a thing is it shows the relation between a noun or pronoun and some other words in a sentence it is used to show the position or location of a noun or pronoun so kids today we will learn some preposition words so the first preposition we are going to learn about is in example the water is in the glass now where you can see the water yes in the glass the fruits are in the basket now kids where you can see the fruits are kept in the basket spoons are in the stand where you can see the spoons in the stand so we learned in which cases we use in now here we have the next preposition and it is on example the birds are on the tree where you can see the birds on the tree the books are on the table kids tell me where the books are kept yes on the table the boy is sitting on the chair where the boy is sitting on the chair so here we learned in which cases we use on okay now we will go on to the next preposition and it is under tiger is sitting under a tree where you can see a tiger sitting under a tree cat is drinking milk under table where cat is drinking milk yes she is drinking milk under the table boy is hiding under the bed where is boy hiding under the bed now we will learn the next preposition and it is over the birds are flying over the bridge where are the birds flying yes over the bridge police jumping over fence where they are jumping over fence deer is jumping over a car where you can see a deer is jumping 
Yes, the deer is jumping over a car. So we learned where we can use over. Right, children? It's time for our next preposition, and it is between. A table has kept between two chairs. Where you can see the table has kept? Yes, between two chairs. Dog is sitting between two girls. Where dog is sitting? Yes, between two girls. A girl is relaxing between two trees. Where she is relaxing? Between two trees. Now we will learn the next preposition and it is among. Mowgli is playing among monkeys. Where you can see Mowgli is playing? Yes, among monkeys. A girl playing among pets. Where girl is playing? Among pets. Kids, there is one thing to remember between the words between and among. That when something is in the center between two things or persons, we say between. And when something or someone is in the center of more than two thing we use among okay so kids today we learned so many prepositions i hope now you know how and where to use them see you in the next period till then Wear your mask and stay safe at home. Bye.